again. Welcome back to Too Crazy About Wood. Recently I've made a mortising attachment for my drill press and it worked very well. Uh, but I found that my drill press just wasn't strong enough, didn't apply enough force to use the bigger mortising bits. So I decided I was going to make my own. So this is all made from uh, 5 8 plywood for the sides in the L shape and I did that on purpose because I wanted that strength uh, and also uh, oak and maple so try to use the really hardwoods um, and I knew I needed a lot of force to uh, to make those square holes to force that chisel in so I, uh, I made a double arm on it and the way I wanted to make sure that all the pressure would would happen at the back of the drill obviously so uh, where the pivotal point is right here all the pressure I've got multi blocks there all hardwood all going into the dovetail slide forward plate now that dovetail slide is not my idea I found that on Matthias Wendel's uh, site excellent site if you ever want to check it out um, his channel is amazing and uh, actually I added a little bit of uh, oil in between the two plates just to make sure we get a good slide and obviously uh, the drill I, I attached it uh, with the battery I used a cordless drill because it's plenty strong enough uh, but I attached it with the battery to the side I didn't want the battery sticking out in the middle I would get in the way probably of the arm and of course just like Matthias's um, drill press uh, I made my own jig the sides I tapered because um, I needed to be able to access the chuck with my, my, my fingers so it's no issues getting to it I can tighten it up enough um, so it's really good that way and then just to hold the work because as you know once you force that mortise a drill bit through your work to pull it back out it takes a lot of force in itself as well so I, I needed some uh, I needed something to hold the work and this is what I came up with a couple of uh, clamps that are modified and attached to the actual drill press so this is my idea I uh, hope you enjoyed the video and uh, please like and subscribe if you did take care I attached the, the jig to the front plate with screws from behind. This two and a half inch screw goes all the way into the back plate. Very important for strength. Also important was to make sure that this deck was well reinforced because it was going to take a lot of abuse.
Thank you. 